Hey guys, this video is regarding Gotaska website and how it functions with our provider application. So like you already know, Gotaska is an Uber for X concept. So you see various of our services listed here from different industries. So let me show you how, how what are the different sort of setups we have done here. We have uh, tutor, massage, uh, cleaner, electrician. So if you notice, notice for tutor and massage they basically you would want to know who the provider is but in case of cleaner or electrician it really doesn't matter who come and does the job so first let me take you through electrician and how that functions so when i click on this category or when you click on any service the first thing they ask you is your location so that they can show you the providers around your location whether you would want a booking for right now or whether it would be for later in case of later you could choose your date uh, but I will show you currently a booking for right now I take this ahead and you can see that we can hire them by the hour or there are certain fixed services which we have set up and you notice that we do not show any providers here because it really doesn't matter who is the provider so if anyone signed up any available provider online the booking goes to them immediately that is the whole concept of on demand and in this case we only set one uniform price there is no price differentiation given to them since it generally has one rate going in the market now let's try to add this in the cart. Alright, so since we haven't logged in, it will ask us to log in. So we basically have guest login. The advantage with guest login is that the customer can explore the website before they have to do this tedious process of logging in or signing up and it is more encouraging for them to sign up. So if you want to sign up here, you can sign up with Facebook or Google or you can either share your email ID and phone number and sign up into the website. I already have signed up so I'll directly log in and if you have forgotten your password, you can retrieve it through your phone number or email ID. So let me continue and log in here. I serve 3mbed at gmail.com. Let's put in the password and we log in. All right, so Edwin is the name of the provider. Now, let me show you how is a marketplace different from. Sorry. That was an earlier booking completed. Yes, so marketplace, let's consider tutor. Again, tutor is, a, is somebody who is dealing with your child. So you would definitely want to have, get a, as much as information possible about the provider. So we allow you to see the provider in this case. And at the same time, we allow the provider to set his own price because as a tutor, I may want to set a different rate depending on my experience and qualification. And Edwin may set up a different price, but we give them a price range, like a lower limit and an upper limit. You see, we have set 150 to 600. That is between, that is what the provider can set the price. I can show that to you here. In the meantime, you can even see how responsive my website is. So that basically makes it uh, very user friendly for your mobile phone, tablet, as well as desktop. Come and this is the provider application that you see. Let's go have a look. If I go to say my rate card. And if I check tutor, price is set by the provider. And you see the 150, 600 tab is right here. If I click on this. You can see 150 to 600 and between that is what he can save and set so that is how it would work but if you check electrician is something we saw it has fixed Ali so since we have since it, let, let us go back there if you there and see that one moment so when you match the electricians uh, details here you see there's a fixed price which has been set up here by the admin and when you click on hourly you see an hourly price and they cannot edit it like i said we set one unique price for this so now let me take you through a booking flow for you to understand the flow uh, let's have cleaner done here we click on the category 
ask for these details and yes and they do not show you any providers like i said it really doesn't matter who comes and cleans your house you just need to select your address you can it gives you the details what do you exactly want to do clean the floors you can choose your payment method either through cash card wallet and we have set this dynamically from the back end depending on the nature of the market or whatever your market is comfortable with so let's have this confirmed uh, before we confirm it we can see that the early rate can be increased or decreased in the cart and let's have a promo code applied here to get a better understanding how that works so this is the month of august i have created one for august and you see a 10 percent discount has been applied now let us go confirm and book this particular job we see and we've seen that he's received the booking we have a look a email has been received so they shows us the details the amount the amount payable after the discount the mode of payment and the message and when you click on this job as well it gives you the required detail if you wish to cancel you could cancel it as well so we shall do that for the next booking let's have this accepted we accept it you see this moves to the assigned status so we know that it has been assigned to a particular provider at the same time it is an upcoming job for the provider let's have this let's have this further minimized to see how would this look on a mobile view there you go so let's have this on the way let's click on his job we see his status is updating there you go and when we click on live track it will show you where exactly is the location of the job and where exactly he is our job location and the location of his current is the same that is our office so hence it is showing this details once he's arrived gives your arrive status shows again all the details as earlier so we start the job now and you see the timer as well starts and it is synced together to make sure it has the right timing then once the job is completed you raise the invoice job is completed the status gets updated and these status get updated on real time if you want you can add a few items say cleaning solutions we could give this 50 bucks and you confirm it and it gets added on to your complete bill the signature happens and then you can have your job as completed and this is how it shows so over here you even see it gets it gives you an email of the wallet credit that you have won received and let us show you the other details over here you get a detail of your total bill amount 266 how have you received it and you can rate them through various parameters here let's have cleanliness focus all these great job through which it's easier for you to assess your provider John in the future and it even allows your future customers to get details of him in case of marketplace where they do show the information let me show you how that looks say I go to tutor next next you go here they show see we just made this comment a couple of seconds ago it shows you zero minutes great job you want to review his profile details it shows all the details for you here and it shows the rating as per what we had given as per our earlier booking so 
this is how the booking goes and how the information of the provider gets correctly updated and it's very important to get the right information so if i am a user it's like a uh, past history for me about the provider and gives me confidence if i should book him or not now let me show you further few more details which are really good about our product Let's see profile here. It shows you your bookings which have been assigned to you, then unassigned, passed, invoice raised, cancelled, and expired as well. You have payment page here as well. You can either add a card over here or you could put in your 16 digits, your uh, validations, or you could recharge your amount. Let's have, say 200 bucks recharge. Confirm, okay. And we can even see a re recent transaction. It's saying, okay, 200. We put in over here through booking ID, we got a wallet recharge of 50 rupees. And what is debited? 80 for a job yesterday. And what has been credited today? They got two credits. So that is also very visibly shown here. And we try to give as, many, as much transparency to the provider and customer and information about whatever transaction they have done. That was a key, that was a key point while uh, having this development done. And if you wish, you can add your addresses here. Like for home, we could have one added. Save and proceed, we have it added. And this information saving allows you to complete your booking process quickly since it's already saved and you can even edit your profile here. So this was what our website was about and we have tried to make it so flexible and so usable that if you just go for the website and the provider application, you can have your business set up and running. You really don't need the customer app here. We have made it responsive for your tablet use, uh, for your mobile phone and your desktop. And it's user friendly and gives you all the information that any app would give it to you as well. So that was our whole objective while developing this application and while developing the website for the application. So if you do have any queries or any further, uh, if you need any further assistance or have any further queries for us regarding the website, please feel free to write to us and we shall be there to assist you. Thank you so much.